Wow 38 Verhonga side missions. We're going to do a few side missions. Uh, the animals are very, uh, very hyper. Yeah. Now there's all kinds of side missions you can do. We're going to do it always see. And of course they always got a thing. Now there's an animal somewhere here. It's best to sneak like this. You've got the hunter's scent. Follow those tracks. Uh, I don't know what he's talking about. Oh, he's talking about them. I'm not worried about them, really. We're going to stay on mission. Uh, now, the mission is the trap raid. So, if you want to know the truth, it's right here. Right here. Animals will hear you for a long ways when you run like this. You get within 100, 125 yards, meters. They kind of get a little bit agitated. <clears throat> now you could run the four ATV over here and just run around, but you will scare everything away. You might as well just run. So we're here at Maui Beach. So what we're doing, we're looking for animals, traps. Sometimes the traps can be hard to find. Just kind of wander around the area. Remember, they will glow gold. And you could run, there's one, see? So there's one here. Right here. You just interact with them when you get up close to them. There's one. Just zigzag around, you'll find them. There's another one. Two. So they're pretty much in a straight line down through here. Usually they are anyhow. There's the third one. So yeah, uh, when you're trying to find the traps, they're right here in a straight line, like one here, and there was one there, and now there's one here. So just saying, they're all in a straight line, pretty easy to find once you find them. And it gives you a pretty good cash bonus, so we'll go up here and see what this is. A lot of jackals right here, I noticed. But we're doing side missions. We'll see what this is. Some of them's pretty good, some of them ain't. And of course, the if you want XP, go do these flags. They, they seem to help, you know, give you quite a bit of XP. And we are hunting. If you we see something, we'll definitely take it. Yeah, this talks about, it uh, used to be one lake one time. Just make sure you got your tutorial and hunt. Make sure it's on. It don't make sense to hide anything. 
they say this one time was one leg so all right now we're going to go do something that leads up to it's called uh, <clears throat> Yeah, that's funny. Of hares and jackals. We're going to do that one. Now the mission right after that's the one I really want to hope to. So we're going to look for some jackals and uh, hares. All you got to do is spot them. You don't have to kill them. But first things first, you got to climb up that tower. Which, it seems to be a long ways off, so. Now you can cut through all the bull. <clears throat> you can kind of cut right through here. You don't have to follow the roads. Never. But it don't make no sense to just follow the road. But if you want to hunt up there, you can hunt up there. You can do any of the things you wish. Just remember, when you're hunting, you're going to see a lot more animals if you go slow. I'm just running for the video's sake because I'm I don't have no way to edit all this. So, but we can talk about things as we go. Now, they changed quite a few things in the game. At least in the Africa map. I know if you shoot an animal in the heart or uh, lung, left lung, right lung hit, it, the integrity is a lot higher. So, <clears throat> you know, or just better than a ra random shot. So I'm, I'm just thinking, you know, they, they did improve some things, but it only worked in this waypoint system. I kind of liked it, but I kind of wish they would do it with the the binoculars. Like when you got the binoculars up, I wish that you could set separate waypoints. Maybe a blue number one, you know, or what have you. See, like if you're looking through the binoculars, you can push like down on the D-pad for one, left to make a two marker, then a, then another marker. Not only up, but maybe flip the three way mark down, you know, I don't know, or push it X, holding X, or something. Or how about the gun fire mechanic, R1, like one, two, it'd be really cool, I think. That's usually a jackal makes that noise. Now, if he cuts through here, you do make better time. And of course, I'll go slower when I get up here a little bit. I should have took the time back. Rabbits. Now, there's plenty of rabbits in the game, that's for sure. You're not going to have any trouble finding rabbits. So the rabbits are probably going to be pretty easy to spot. Travel. The behavioral reports on scrap hares and side scrap jackals in Zippo and the Amber are concerning. Now you don't have to go up the tower to spot these animals. animals. So smaller species like hare and jackal have always flourished there. But both populations are outgrowing the balance of the environment. The hairs reproduce so quickly they will, what's the word, saturated the jackals, who can't eat them quickly enough. Without more aggressive predators to cull them, soon those hairs will overpopulate the region. For their part, the lucky jackals are glutting themselves on easily accessible hair meat. 
That makes them slow, lazy, and more prone to threats from other predators who might enter the territory. Not to mention they could die out if the land can't sustain the head. So between motivating lazy jackals and pressuring happy scrappers, you've got work to do. Nimmer, uh, dusk, <clears throat> dawn, and night are the best times for. There's one, so see all you do, spotty. I bet this scrub is thinking about making more babies right now. It's a wonder they have time for anything else. That's one half of this devil. I always said I wanted to shoot one with one little boom stick. Now find the other. I just want to shoot one of the boom set. That's the damn good now. Rolling. Right in the rear end. So, jackals. I always find them kind of like up here. If you find our track. Now, I don't know if you can spot one from the But you can get up on that bank and sometimes make a better, I don't know, I think the better lookout is up on the hill. And since it's getting close to evening, It can definitely take some time to find a jackal.
Now the predator collar don't seem to be working much on uh, the one item, so on the Or you can just keep coming back looking for a trail. Probably stand hunting is the best way to spot some of these animals.
course right up there is the exit of the case and there's the old dead tree where you buried the jackal skull Yes, sometimes this game requires patience uh, if you're wanting quick action games uh, this is probably not the game for you I'll be quite honest with you uh, the game requires some patience at times but it is a beautiful game the Verhaga Savannah is awesome. It don't matter where you see the jackal as long as you spot it. We'll head back to the other hut.
So I'm taking time back to six. Sometimes it's best to, uh, like if you're backpacking, is uh, unequip your nitro and equip a tent and put it up there. Sometimes that helps out tremendously. Now the next mission after this, mission here of hares and jackals, uh, you get to rebuild the bridge that you fell through, <laughs> which is always good. big fail. That's very old. I just like to see you be a little more invisible in the tower. 
I mean, you stick out like a sore thumb. So this will be like a buffer when you're tracking, looking for other animals or whatever. You have a place to come back, refresh, set reset time. That's jackal tracks right there. But I'd say it's very old. You got a better chance of running up on them on, on an ATV.
<laughs> a little harder to hit. So I hope everybody's enjoying the Rohonga. There is an update coming. They've been talking about that for a while now. For PC consoles. When? I don't know. But they said it's a huge update. So they must be still working on it. There's a coyote. Lazy, lazy sights try the jackal. The jackal thrives when it is competing within the food chain, not when it's the apex. So he see me. So now we can fix the bridge. That takes care of both parties and confirms that the reports of their activity are true. So there you go. To just simply go back now, to the... before you go stirring up hares and jackals every which way, let's give them a new pathway to migrate from the plateau. That broken bridge you fell from earlier, it's time to fix that safety hazard. Yeah. Not only for people's sake, not only to restore a primary game trail, but also for you to take revenge against the bridge that dropped you. So, just, you know, be careful up there. They it's say right here. never strikes the same place twice, but my friend, Jaffa has been struck three times. I think you will have better luck than Jaffa, though. Fix that bridge. There's some more industry like that. I mean, we done a little bit. We didn't get to hunt much, but we sure did do the side missions. You can see that they, they can be done. So, just follow this road. This road will turn into a uh, terrible road. Just keep following it. It'll branch off to the right. And after we rebuild the bridge, we'll stop the stream. I don't know what kind of map would you everybody like to see next. I'd kind of like to see Alaska. I, I mean, that's what I would like to see. So remember, it's just a little trail here. Just little game trails like this, see? <laughs> so if you follow this far enough, you will come to the bridge that fell through. That you fell through in the Ghost Hunter one.
Yeah, like I said, this is just a personal thing. Like, this is an old bridge, walkway. You can look out from it if you want, but there's no lookout perspective from it. Just show you some interesting things. So now we're going to head to the uh, bridge and repair the bridge. Uh, so what you do, you got to go to your it's safety hazard. So it shows it on the map, of course. You're just going to run over here and repair it and follow the trail. It is. A, it does restore a game trail for animals to walk across. I don't know what map would you like to see him. Uh, Whoa! Oh, about the over. <laughs> It is a wonder you didn't break both your legs in the fall. Further proof of your noise lineage. Now you... The broken bridge, see. Now we can get across the bridge. <laughs> if it was that easy, why didn't you just do that before? At least now you can use this pathway. Yeah, but you can't run your forward or cross. <laughs> Harvest three side strap jackals from this region. Doing so will put the lazy dogs back on a lead. But this won't be that easy. Each jackal must be harvested with a hundred percent integrity. That will qualify them for a local diet study, which will tell us how balanced, or in this case, imbalanced, their breeding habits have become. That's a sorry here. But thank you. Thank you for watching. Uh, have a good one. Peace out.